temple and as Prabhuji has described, so I'll try to speak uh, the gist because uh, it's too long and all of us will have lost time. So we know that Kansa has prison his father with his friend and he has taken over the uh, empire himself and he has appointed all the demons and monsters as his ministers and advisors. So what he was trying now, because earlier we know when he married his uh, sister Devaki, his Vastu Dev, and when he was taking them, taking Devaki to her in-laws place, then a voice from the sky came and in that voice he heard that that the eighth child of her sister will kill him. So when he heard this, immediately his whole mood changed and with his left hand he caught hold of uh, Devaki's hair and with right hand he took a sword and he was about to kill his sister. Some of the other Vasudev, he pacified him and he saved Devaki at that time and he said, okay, if the eighth child is going to kill you, so what we will do, we'll make an agreement that I will give you all the ch children when they're born, I'll, one by one I'll hand over them to you and then you can kill them or whatever you do, it's up to you. So Kansa, he, got, he, he said, okay, uh, I believe your words because Masadev was known that he speak, he's a truthful person and he always keep his words. Now, we know how he killed all the six children which, uh, which were given birth by Devaki and the seventh womb was a miscarriage and in the eighth we know how Krishna went to Gokul and in exchange of him a uh, girl born to Ishoda was brought here uh, uh, in the prison of Kansa and then Kansa he tried to kill that girl she flew in, in the air and then she said that oh Kansa and she took the form of Durga Devi which was the worshipable deity of uh, Kansa and she said what will you kill how will you kill me it's not possible for you but the one who is going to kill you has taken birth somewhere else in Raja or she didn't name she said somewhere he has taken birth so Kansa then what he did he called Putna and he said that you should go and you kill all the big children who has taken birth in last 10 days so she was that cruel and she went on for that job and after that also he sent so many demons Agasur, Bakasur, Tinnabra, Chaktasur, you know, all the Pralambasur and when all his attempts failed and he could not kill Krishna then he made a plan with a crew he sent a crew to get Krishna and Baladev here so that here when he is in his area, in Kansa's area then Kansa can kill him easily so then he made a very nice assembly here uh, and he made an arrangement for a wrestling match and he called all his big uh, uh, demon-like uh, powerful persons or his uh, followers Charud Mustik and etc. and as soon as they will come, they will, uh, Krishna but they will come, they will make a uh, joint effort and they will kill them. So we know how they came here and one after another Krishna and Baldev, they, they defeated all them, all of them and killed them and when Kansa he was, he was curated, he was really, uh, uh, when he saw this, that he was unable to kill Krishna then also, then he was very frustrated. And he was saying that now what to do. And when he was thinking like that, Krishna, he jumped on the uh, throne where Kansa was sitting and he pulled him from his shikha and brought him down. And then just with one fist, he killed him and he jumped on his chest and then he pressed his neck and he was finished. So then he went in the prison and he rescued Devaki and Vasudev. But when Devaki and Vasudev they came out, they were not sure that Kansa is killed and they were still afraid and they were thinking, oh, if Kansa gets up any moment now, he will kill every one of, each one of us. So Krishna said, and Krishna and Baldev said, no, you don't worry, he is fully, he's, he's no life, he's completely killed. So just to make sure what he did, they dragged him from here to Dhruvgarh, the place where he went where he was given his uh, cremation ceremony. So the, play, the pathway which they followed, uh, these days there is a drain here. It was created from dragging Kansa. So this drain is named as Kans Har. Big drain. So all dirty water of Matra comes in this way. <laughs> so that's how they uh, assured everyone that Kansa is killed. And so that was the pastime of this place. Rangeshwar Mahadev Ki!